So now that you've mastered calculating board feet for different sized pieces of wood, let's apply the concept to a whole project. As you can see, we have this bill of materials for the end table. It lists all the parts, how many pieces there are per part, and the thickness, width, and length of each part. The columns just happen to match the equation. Board feet equals the number of pieces times thickness times width times length divided by 144. We have number of pieces times thickness times width times length. So simply, we need to round these numbers to the nearest inch. Remember, we always round to keep math simple. Then we multiply across these four columns. And then we divide by 144. It's as simple as 1, 2, 3. Now, whenever we have a 1 in the table, we're not going to key that into the calculator because we all know that any number times 1 is itself. So for the top, the thickness will round to 1. So we can do 14 times 20 divided by 144. Gives us 1.94 repeating. 4 will round down. So the answer will be 1.94. Next for the shelf, 1, this rounds to 1, half rounds up to 12, half rounds up to 18. So we can do 12 times 18 divided by 144, 1.5. For the long rails, there's two of them. Thickness will be 1, 2 inches wide by 15. So we can do 2 times 2 times 15 divided by 144 equals 0.42 short rails 2 times 1 times 2 times 9 0.25 finally there's four legs thickness and width 1 and 3 quarters each round to 2 20 and a quarter rounds down to 20 4 times 2 times 2 times 20 equals divided by 144. 2.22 repeating. We'll round down to 2.22.